How's it going everyone? It's Gadgets Boy. Welcome to another video. And to my right, to your left, is the new DeLonghi Prima Donna Soul. I like what they did with the name there. I see what you did there, DeLonghi. Uh, but this is a fantastic machine. It's fully automatic and uh, it's bean to cup, ready to go. And it's just so easy to use. It's got the new bean adapt technology there as well, working to make sure that you're getting the best quality out of your coffee beans as well. And uh, it's just simple to use. It comes with a coffee link app as well, which means you can use your phone uh, to make, create your own coffee. Uh, control that bean adapt technology, modify it if you like to, or leave it to fully automate, or to automate uh, what you need to do, what you need to get out of your coffee. And also, just we're going to go through how to set it up, unbox it, show you what's in the box when you get one of these. And uh, also, this is a coffee that I made earlier, cappuccino, and I'm going to drink that as well. I can't wait to actually drink this. But in the meantime, let's get on with it and see what you get in the box and how to set it up and everything else. This is the new DeLonghi Prima Donna Soul. It's a full automatic bean to coffee machine with bean adapt technology. It's by far one of the easiest coffee machines I've ever set up and used, and it connects to my phone using the DeLonghi Coffee Link app for more ease of use. In the box, you have everything you need to get started. You will just need to get your milk, water, and coffee beans or ground coffee. You have the DeLonghi Prima Donna Soul itself, a three pin power cord, cleaning brush, the scaling spout, the scaler, water softener filter, coffee pot, total hardness test indicator paper, and a milk container which is also detachable so you can put it in the fridge once you're done making coffee. Closer look at the milk container, you'll notice the froth level dial that's on top, and you can take the lid off to clean the milk intake tube, and you can also remove the milk container connector too. You can also adjust the milk sprouts nozzle for the size of the cup you're using. On the right side of the Prima Donna Sol, you can slide out the water tank and insert the water softener filter. Fill it up to the max line and slide it back in, and while I have it out here, you can also see the removable infuser. To the front, you have a 4.3 inch TFT full touch color display. Below the display, you have a spout door with a slider. To the right of it, the coffee and hot water spout with adjustable height. You can also remove the front cover to reveal the spout itself so you can take it out for cleaning. Going further down, we have the coffee grounds container where you can remove it to empty it out and the drip tray. The drip tray has a water level indicator and when you remove the whole thing, you have the condensate tray. On top of the Prima Donna Sol, there's a coffee cup tray, pre-ground coffee measure, and underneath it is a pre-ground coffee funnel, which is also removable. Moving on, you have a beans container and the power button next to the pre-ground coffee area. On the back, you have the power connector and a pop-out power button. Now onto the setup process. Once you have some water in the tank, milk in the milk container, and coffee beans in the coffee beans container, power it on. You will need to insert the descaling spout first, so put the milk container aside for now. When you press the power on button, the screen activates and you will need to select the language preference, your language preference, press OK and the machine will fill the water circuit. It sounds loud at first as it, you know, fills the water circuit to get it set up, up and running. And then once you switch it on, and then once you use it further down the line, it gets quieter. The longest says you will need to make four to five cups of cappuccinos before the result becomes satisfactory. Once you have finished with the initial setup, store the descaling sprout safely as you will need this for regular cleaning uh, maintenance in the future. Now insert your milk container and finish the rest of the setup process. One thing I really like here in the packaging is the bean selection cards, which lets you choose the right beans for your settings. Like for example, I'm using a medium coffee beans here and for the pre-ground coffee, I'm using a medium to dark. Next is to download the coffee link app, register, log in, and on the machine, go to connectivity settings to activate Wi-Fi and remote control for the app to recognize the Prima Donna Sol. The DeLonghi Prima Donna Sol is super easy to use. On the digital display, you can select from up to 19 options preloaded on there already, ready to go. If you decide to make a latte or cappuccino, Prima Donna Sol comes with DeLonghi's latte crema system. So all you have to do is select the froth level and you get the best milk foam possible with the perfect density, creminess, and the perfect temperature as well. And for convenience, the froth adjustment and clean is now automatic. In terms of milk compatibility, you can use non-dairy alternatives such as soy, rice, and almond milk too. On the main screen, you'll notice that headshot icon. And tapping this will reveal up to five profiles. So in a household with different people with different preferences, you can create different profiles for everyone. So in the morning, tap your profile and there you go. All your settings will be there. You'll also notice the Bean Adapt technology button and what this does is adjust the grinding level, dosing and temperature of extraction for each coffee type that you have selected. The machine basically adapts to your bean to match the coffee selected. Using the Coffee Link app, you're able to adjust the bean adapt settings. 
yourself so you can adjust the aroma and the strength or let the machine do it all for you. The longest coffee link app also lets you select a coffee you want, create your own and change the settings and it's very smooth. The coffee that you've created is also populated on the main screen so if you slide all the way across you can see the ones that you've then created. You can create your own from scratch or you can go buy one of the already made set up one preloaded ones and modify it to suit your taste. You can also get creative and see on the app they've got uh, an area where you can see what people are making with it and you can sort of adapt and create something similar. Overall I love the ease of setup and use. The Bean Adapt technology works really well with each cappuccino I've made tasting really nice and looks very nice with that layered uh, sort of setup that you can see and the coffee link app is a bonus for someone like me who just wants to wake up first thing in the morning and select the coffee before I even get out of bed. What I'd like to see from DeLonghi is the coffee link app working on my Apple smartwatch as well. That aside though, my cappuccino tastes really balanced, it's just the right amount of milk and coffee and the coffee bean grinding and aroma is really spot on. So that's it for the DeLonghi Prima Donna Soul fully automatic coffee machine, bean to cup uh, coffee machine with bean adapt technology there as well. Guys, as always, if you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. All relevant links will be in the description area, but in the meantime, make sure you give it a thumbs up, share it as well, and subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that bell notification as well. So you'll be one of the first people to know every time there's a video up on the channel. Thanks for watching, see you in the next one.